Raiho Whitep Satinka Manor and Squest to Takamisha Sequin. Dine Oppenheimer and Kika and Squest, Dave Manor and Katra and Squest. Hello everyone, my name is Tinka Manuel. I come from Camels, BC. My mom's name is Diane Oppenheim, my dad's name is Dave Manuel. Welcome to fellow students, teachers, friends, and all the cousins. It was a great honor to be here addressing everyone that's come to support us on this great accomplishment in our young lives. Never thought this day would come fast enough. Not only because we're counting down days in excitement since the start of our grade 12 year, but we didn't know when or if a graduation ceremony would occur for the class of 2020. It's unfortunate our grad is occurring like this. Despite not being a traditional grad, this will always be a moment in our lives to remember. I'm so happy to say that we made it. We made it to this moment in our lives. We have all overcome obstacles that some might have been greater than others, but nevertheless, we made it. We made it together. I would now like to share this quote with you by Richard Wahagamese. In our teaching way, an honor song is sung, in recognition of the spirit. The more voices raised, the stronger the song revibrates allowing to resonate from our physical plane outward into our spiritual plane. While the ancestors join the celebration, such a song can bring all of our energies into line. When that happens, we truly become one song, one drum, being together in a common purpose, and we are healed. I find this quote extremely related to 2020. This year was like a crazy lesson time for my ancestors. It was full of challenges to overcome, and when we overcome those challenges, we learn something. What we learn may look different to others, but personally, what I learned is sitting down eating a farmer's wrap from Tim's with my friends is something to value, as we now don't get to do that. I learned the value of a hug is something I will no longer take for granted, as it's something I longed for during those months of quarantine. We didn't get the chance to be together physically, but we were spiritually, and that itself is a powerful thing. Now, we can all celebrate together that we made it past those five years of high school and the COVID-19 pandemic. But most importantly, the long lines in Costco for the precious toilet paper. We are graduating a pandemic that may be seen as a scary thing, but think about all the opportunities and challenges COVID has created for us. I know if any grad class is gonna get through this, it'll be us, and we will. Okay, now I want you to vision yourself in an Indian car. In the passenger seat is your parent or guardian holding the map to help give you directions on this long car ride called life. In the back seat are the teachers that help give you tools for life, almost like giving you snacks on the road. It's very essential. Like knowing that mitochondria is a powerhouse of the cell. Also in the back seat is your friends you made along the way. They've, made, they've helped make life and car rides more fun. On behalf of the Aboriginal class of 2020, I'd like to say thank you to all people who have joined us in our cars to help us. Now, let's give a shout out to the drivers of your car, yourselves. You may have gotten a few dents or scratches in your car by now, but hey, you made it in one piece. You now have the direction, the tools, and you know how to have some fun. So go enjoy this re the rest of this exhilarating Indian car ride, wherever it may take you. Congratulations, grad class of 2020, Cook Shatcham.